hello out there and welcome to English to Plays. We're here with True Driver, which is a new game. It's on Steam and we're going to play. Hold up. All right, let's look at the how to play. Movement is with Waz, I guess. Handbrake is space, lights is F, slow motion is Q. Radio, map, I'm guessing this is gonna demonetize my channel, so I don't like getting demonetized, but it doesn't look like there's a way to turn the music off. That's right, we're gonna play. Let's do the tutorial. Let's get, get amongst it. Just gonna turn it down a little bit though. Welcome to True Driver, okay? Move your car by AWSD or arrows. Space is for handbrake. Some props aren't static. You can drive through them. Press Q for slow motion. Nice. Okay, in case of bad camera view, you can reset the camera position by pressing C. Okay, the car handles like a pile of bricks. It's the what? It's the... I don't know what that says. That's right. Press R for radio. All right, we'll leave the radio off so that we don't uh, get demonetized. Oh. All right, so there's a map. Oh, love this view. Um, okay. Right. There are several challenges in free mode marked on the map. Oh, I see. So we gotta go into the thing and start the challenge, okay? When we touch the columns, we lose. Okay, so then we have to restart. Wow, okay, let's try it one more time. I mean, we're just gonna lose again, right? So, oh, God, the car just handles terribly. I just wanna do it and see what, like, kind of reward we get. So I'm gonna go very slowly um, so that I don't hit the columns. Right. We're going for a high score. Hey! Okay. Collect all the canisters or you'll be out of fuel. Alright. Right. We ran out of fuel! Woof. Okay. Collect all the coins. Try to finish in the shortest time. Oh my god. Right. So, my question is, who is this for? Why, why would you make this? Why would you make this? I don't... Right, so I'm getting further away from it. I don't, I don't actually know, man. I, I, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing here. We'll go around the back of this. Yeah. I found it! 
Okay, so we did a bunch of things. Countdown that can be selected from the main menu. Just get at, get to the finish before the timer runs out. Oh, there's a helicopter. Okay. I have finished the tutorial. Great. Um... Okay. Fantastic. Let's let's go. S oh my god. Okay. I'll drive that one. So this thing basically drives exactly the same as the other car. Why wouldn't it? Oh, yeah. Um. Okay. Uh, I can tell you that... Uh, I'm just going to turn it down, man. It's very loud in my earballs. Uh, um. The actual... Oops, that's not what I want to do. The actual driving feels terrible. The cars are slow and unresponsive and they hit stuff and basically it just, there's no point to it. Um, oh, here's a mission. Let's go do a mission. It'll be collect five things. Yeah. Right. Yep. Okay. We are collecting coins. Great. Excellent. I mean, it looks like someone spent some time making some levels. There is that. Is that the last coin? Oh, there's 34 coins. Oh my god. Okay. Well, I'm not doing that, am I? Because the coins don't lead in a path. Man, driving just feels terrible. It just isn't fun to drive around at all. Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah, I don't, uh, I don't think we're, lo I don't, yeah, okay, let's go to the main menu. Let's try a hella race. Um, okay, let's try the old town road, I guess. I, I don't know, man. So, how... How am I meant to know which way I'm supposed to be going? It doesn't actually tell me which way to go. Is, I mean, is this the right way? Am I, am I winning the race? This, is, this doesn't feel like the right way to go. I don't, I don't know, there's a, there's a helicopter Oh, the helicopter's above, so maybe I am, maybe I am going the right way. Really hard to say. Like, there's no way, I don't know, man. Okay. So, we're driving. Yeah, I mean, how, how would you... How would you race the helicopter, man? It just... Did I lose? I don't... Is this the racetrack? There's so many uh, paths that it doesn't make any sense. Oh, man, this car... 
Hoops, try it again. No, I'm not trying it again. That was terrible. Okay, so Hella Race is terrible. Let's try Countdown. Why are there so many more maps for Countdown? Um. Uh, let's go to Site 22, I guess. Uh, what car? Haven't we? we haven't driven this yellow car. Oh, it's actually green. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Oh, there's an arrow. Oh, that fence doesn't work. Okay, so there's another arrow. Uh, okay. Why are there helicopters in the air? I just... Where are we go- Where are we meant to go? This makes no sense. Ugh. The cars just drive so terribly, man. They just, they, they like, they all turn from the back like that. It just, there's, there's no, there's no sense of driving them. They're not actually driving, they're just. I mean, someone went through and made a bunch of levels and it's just bad, okay. Um. Let's go to the jump park. I, I mean, we may as well go somewhere and try something. Uh, I like this car the best, I guess. We jumped. So it lied about jumping. Mostly it's just terrible driving and... And nothing. Cool. All right. Well, I think that's a pretty good uh, summation of of the game there. I'll grab a screen grab of that because that can be my um, that can be the the thumbnail for this video. Love it. Let's go look at the description and see what the game has to say for itself. All right, true driver, take a seat, start the engine, and enjoy high speed. Choose between free mode, countdown, and hella race. If you like challenges, you are at the right place. Race with time or with a helicopter. Sounds easy, right? Your blist car is prepared for your journey, so what are you waiting for? Developed by Creative Seal and released today, it currently costs $17.49. I mean, someone made a game, and that's probably all I can say about it, is that they, they did make a game. There is a game here. If you like terrible driving mechanics and for basically identical cars like the the handling on them is there's no difference there um and a bunch of terrain to get stuck on as the driver then this is the game for you also um if you like races where there's just no way of knowing which way you're supposed to be driving then this game is also for you um, True Driver is a single player 3D car game with a bunch of challenges. You can choose between four cars with which you can accomplish the challenges. There are three modes to play, Free Mode, Countdown, and Hella Race. Free Mode, take a ride and enjoy the freedom. Explore the area, break the fence of your neighbor, or accept challenges. Each location has its challenges. The fun begins. Free Mode has available an option of music and radio, map for orientation, and of course, slow motion. There are two maps plus old version of the first map from first version of the game. There are 47 challenges in this, in this mode at all. Challenges. Collect the coins. Fuel trouble. You can't touch this. SOS. There are 16 levels and every level is different. Countdown. Get ready. Start. Get to the finish line before the time runs out. One mistake can cost everything. Slow motion could be useful. Go to several locations from the desert to the big city and win the race. Hell race. Can a car beat a helicopter? Can you reach the destination before the helicopter? We'll see race with the helicopter and get to the finish at as first 
Good luck. Hellarays has four maps for beating the helicopter. A short tutorial will show you all the functions, modes, and controls. Yeah, so one of the main problems is that all the races, um, there's no sort of, uh, there's nothing identifying where the race is. I mean, like, you must have played other games where there are races, uh, and knowing where the racetrack is visually is really important. Um, if a player doesn't know where the racetrack is visually, then you can't really play it. See, I did that, that tank race and there was just no way of knowing which way I was supposed to go because the game, I mean, I ended up, I ended up going that way where it says, but like no way for me to know that just literally no way for me to know that. And also no way to know which way you're supposed to be going. Cause the hell the helicopter, I guess, doesn't follow you. Um, it's not going the same path that you're going, so it can just fly straight. So yeah, problems, man, problems. The other thing is, is the driving feels terrible. Um, accelerating is nonsense. Hitting anything is, uh, basically a stop to the game. There, uh, the controls, the, the cars all pivot from, from the back. They just pivot like that. Um, as if they were like a door on like a hinge, um, rather than sort of naturally curving like cars actually do. Um, I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm trying to give good feedback here, but I just don't know who this game is for. There are just so many better games to race. Uh, if you're trying to make a racing game stand out, like making a bunch of maps with your four cars and then putting some big coins in it is not the way to stand out. The, there's nothing in this game that another game hasn't done just a trillion times better. And I'm not saying that, you know, every game needs to be better than every game before it. Sometimes it's fun just to make a game. But this game just literally isn't doing anything. It has nothing to say. It has nothing new to offer the racing enthusiast landscape. It's just a big nothing burger. I mean, the only thing that I can say that I, I feel like you spent a lot of time on and it is interesting is the maps that you've made. But even then, because the maps are interesting, they're also not because you haven't made it obvious where the racetrack is. So yeah, let's look at creative seal as developer and see what else they've got. So this is their first game. Only game makes sense. Yeah. My best advice here, man is uh, unless there's a bunch of asset packs, which I'm not sure if it is or isn't, um, then you've got some talent for designing levels and stuff. Get with someone and actually make a game with like a story and do like a single player racing game or just something, um, design some levels for it and actually make a game that people will play. I, I, like you've made a single player game here, but there's no reason to do any of the stuff that you've, you've provided. This is the sort of thing that you would make and show your friends and you guys would have a fun weekend messing around in your game, but like selling it for what amounts to like 13 bucks US is just... I get it, you put a lot of time into it and you want to earn some money from it, but no one's going to buy this because it's not saying anything. It's not offering anything new, and the gameplay is really bad. So, yeah, so that's it. That's True Driver. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Leave me a comment down, to, down below. Uh, check out the game by clicking on the link in the description, and I'll see you guys next time. Class dismissed.